With MacBook and macOS system, you can record screen with hotkey Control Shift 5. You can select the size of the record screen and you can select audio options. But the audio is only can record from the mic. You cannot loop the playing out audio from the clip. As you can see, if you open the audio setup, there's only an internal mic and internal speaker. So I make this loopback cable. I can loop the play out audio back to the mic input without any noise inset. As you can see, when I insert the cable, it shows the external mic and external headphone. Now the option has the external mic option. You can select the audio from the external mic. For example, we play a clip from the YouTube and the actual play out audio is looped back to the mic for recording on the screen. There's a 3.5 millimeter jack available. You can plug in the headphone to listen what actually is playing while you are recording. Okay, now we can play the record clip. Here's the actual audio. So if you like the video and would like to see more DIY projects, please subscribe to my channel and ring the bell so you can get notifications. Here is the actual circuit. In the Mac, there is a headphone output, headphone and mic combination. It is a 4 prong connector. From tip to bottom is left, right, ground and mic input. You will need the cable, something like this, to split out the mic and the headphone. On the headphone side, the three connectors. On the mic is two one ground pin. At the mic pin, I measured 2.5 volt. So inside the mic, there must be a pull-up resistor with some voltage to fit the condenser mic circuit. So that's the mic input. On the phone output, usually it's just two airbox or headphone, two speakers, something like that. At the mic tip, when there is a certain kilo ohm resistance, the Mac will detect this external mic. So I put a 15k resistor there, and I use a 47 microfarad capacitor to loop the audio output back to the mic input. So the audio play out from the headphone and look back to the mic input purely in circuit. That's what the cable looks like. And I seal with the hot glue. 